29B was one of the basic infrastructures established alongside the University of Medugri in 1975 to enhance the objectives of its parent institution. It was initially housed in the formal anatomy library of the College of Medical Science of the University before it was moved. At the end of 1977 stroke 1978 session into a two-floor building inherited from the NECAS. The building itself was named Ramat Library in the honor of the late head of state and commander-in-chief of the armed forces of Nigeria, General Murtala Ramat Mohammed, who was killed on February 13, 1976, in an abortive coup. The key staff of NECAS Library, including the college librarian, Mr. N. O. Ita, who later became the founding university librarian from 1976 to 1977, as well as its collection of 19,000 volumes of books and 500 periodicals from the new clause of the university library. Presently, the library's holdings include over 296,900 volumes of books and 500 periodic titles. The basic objectives of the Ramat Library are to provide materials in support of the learning process, that is, material for students' coursework, assigned reading as well as background for essay, term papers, and projects. Provide materials to meet the requirements of faculty specialists. Also, to provide materials to assist the library user in his own personal self-development to also cooperate with other university libraries with a view of developing a network of academic library resources that are at the disposal of all students and teaching faculties and to meet the specialized information needs of the community within which the university is situated. <laughs> Uh, well, the library as it is is the, is the central uh, department of the university, which uh, has a stock reading materials for reading and research for students and the university community at large. There's no way you come to the university without having to visit the library because we have books for all the departments of the university. So we sustain the academic activities of the, uh, of the university through the provision of books and other reading materials. So uh, the concept, the library was established to cater for the reading and the learning uh, processes of the university. And uh, as students are registered, we also encourage them to register with the library so that they can benefit from the resources. We have books and journals and all the e and also e resources in the library. So there is no way you will be admitted into the university without uh, you know, utilizing the resources in the library. So we in the library believe that as you know, students, your activities will revolve around your the uh, classroom, library, and then the hostel. You know, with the coming of the new technology, you know, students who prefer to browse, you know, rather than to really come and make use of the uh, books available in the library. The only time you see students actually coming to the library is during the exams. But notwithstanding, we encourage them. That is why, you know, when students are newly admitted during the orientation program, we intimate them with the services provided by the library. Because you can come and borrow books, and then you can have books for leisure, you have newspapers that will give you information about what is happening within your immediate environment and around the world. So the students come, but not as we would want to, you know, expect that. Uh, at least as a university, you know, you are supposed to make use of uh, the library as much as possible. But this is uh, 
not too satisfactory or actually. Mm -hmm. Due to the advancement in technology, the Ramat Library also make provision of the computers, that is the e-library, for students to get information online. The e-library is an online library that stores content digitally and is accessible via the internet. E-library retrieves comprehensive yet accurate information that is 100% secure and virus-free. Delivering it instantly at the click of the mouse across the internet. This efficient and interactive software platform boosts the most up to date information on every subject that is quickly retrievable by keying in some elementary fields in the search options. This eliminates the innumerable hours spent crawling search engines, which more often than not spouse out contradicting and unreliable information while restricting unnecessary internet access, which is difficult to control and monitor. As you can see, I believe you've seen the systems around. Uh, well, we have 100 in total. We have 170 computers within e-library and the library. Uh, we have 90 computers downstairs. We have 60 upstairs where the NITDA gave us an intervention with um, 30 kVA inverter and everything. Then we also have 10 distributed to different units within the library. Just in, uh, we are trying to automate the library so that we make the work easier for everyone. Students do come around. They do come around and uh, for their assignments, they they search because we have also internet data because all the systems you're seeing here are wirelessly connected to internet, and we have a very good uh, bandwidth. We subscribe, and they they, call, they do come here for their they search for um, online materials. Some come for e-books, some comes for journals, articles, so many. They are always available for students to use uh, whenever they slide, you know, the university. Um, well, in um, the e-library, we have, apart from the institutional website which we have for the University of Meduguri, we also have a website for the e-library on its own, which we have linked to the institutional website. And um, so once you go through the institutional website on the net, you can see library. Once you click to library, it will redirect you to our uh, website where we have so many databases. We have a lot of things on our website, like databases, um, online, offline databases, so many of them. Uh, we, have, we have like between 50 to 60 databases, different databases where a student can access and have uh, different types of uh, e-materials, be it e-journals, e-books, articles, and so on. We have them online. And uh, the reason why we have all these on our website is because we it's not necessary. That's the reason why we say e-electronic library. You don't really have to come to the library to access these materials. That's why we put it online. You can access them from your hostels. You can access it from your room. You can access it globally in as much as you have our login details. So I think uh, I, we are trying to do more. Between 50, we are trying to have like maybe 100 or above databases. And we also have useful sites where you can have access to books, especially e-books, uh, medical books, and what have you. That are some of the students, or not even students, some of the researchers are not even aware of until when you visit uh, our website and I give you the link is www.unimetlibrary.com So now we're going to be moving straight to the student to ask them what they have to say about the library. I'm just here to ask you about the importance of the library, the relevance of the library to you. 
liking. Um, library is very, very important to me because I'm as a student. Um, I need to know much about my. For instance, now I'm a student of library information science. Without coming to the library, I can't know much about it. For me to know much about the library, I have to come and get more to, uh, uh -huh, you know, So I have current book here, which is um, the information are very current, and I think the resources are enough for a student to come and maybe. Check or no. Suleiman Baba Maki from the Department of Geology. Okay, so what has you to tell us the relevance of the library today? Oh, the relevance of Aramad Library in West of Meduguri. It is of a great relevance, more especially it helps me in my extraordinary researches. Basically, for instance, this morning I was given uh, some terms in the class by my physics teacher to come and find their meanings. So if the library wouldn't have been here, and if it is not relevant to me, you see, that I need to go to somewhere which is other than this place to look for it, and it will be a lot of stress on me. So the, relevant, the library is very, very relevant and useful to me. So